Well, we wrote it on the road. <laughs> it was a collaborative process in a way. I mean, you know, I, I, I established the, the groundwork and then we just sort of worked out from yeah. there. Well, I'm dazed and confused. Is it stay, is it go? Am I being used? I'd just like to know. The Yardbirds were here seeing you play Dazed and Confused. Mm -hmm. Yeah, they did. And uh, they liked it, and they went out and uh, they bought the album. And um, they came back and they learned it, and they, they played my version. They gave me credit for the song. I'm dazed and confused. Is it stay, is it go? Give me a clue, cause I just want to know. Give me a clue as to where I am at. Feel like a mouse and you act like a cat. And then, of course, the, the other thing happened. What is the other thing? Well, we, we, if we don't know, I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna. <laughs> no, okay, I'll help you. So Led Zeppelin. <laughs> Thank you. Led, Led Zeppelin. What happened next? Yeah, no, Led Zeppelin recorded it, and, and mm -hmm. what did you think when you saw the first? Wait, first of all, I wasn't paying attention to rock and roll at that time, and I had no idea, so, okay, they stole it, what the heck. I had no idea the song was as successful as it was. A lot of lawyers told me it was too late to do anything. I've been dazed and confused. So long is not true. What a woman never bargain for you. Sweet little baby, say what you will. Because of Procol Harum, the, the, the lawsuit for White Shade of Pale, which was from back in the same kind of days, and there's some lawyer from California said, it's a precedent, so let's see if we can do something. So it was good, and they, they you know, they've, they've been good. The way I look at it is that Jimmy Page took that song and he made it into something really cool. Um, you know, my version was a much smaller, um, different thing. I mean, I think he should, I wish he hadn't changed the words, um, because I think the words were a little hipper than, than his words. I'm dazed and confused, hanging on by thread. Am I being refused? I'd be better off dead. I can't stand this tease and I'm starting to crack. If you're out to get me, How is Days and Confused credited now? I think it's I'm inspired. I inspired them. The Jimmy Page version is inspired by me, but there's still my version. It's not inspired by nobody. <laughs> just, I didn't, I, not, I'm not inspired by Jimmy Page. I was writing a lot of songs for my ex-wife. What I was focusing on was sort of revenge. I was saying, you know, look, see, I, I, I got, I, I'm, I'm, I'm a successful songwriter, you know. She can make a pirouette of feeling turn and turn inside me every time we touch. I wanted to see how, how I could get, how do you say that, um, as deep as I could into the into that feeling of when you're, it's just like you're nutty about somebody and it's like, and, and it's just stupid. And the, and the lyric is stupidly romantic, but in a good way. Zij verstaat de kunst van bij me horen. In mijn lichaam heeft ze plaats gemaakt voor twee. In mijn ogen woont ze. Were you aware at the time that there was a Dutch version that was pretty popular? No, I had no idea. I think somebody sent it to me, but you know, Holland's such a small country. I didn't know. What, you know just looking at, no, I'm kidding. <laughs> no, it um, is. Because I, I was there. No, I was there. Um, I, I, I performed there. Um, I loved that. I loved being there. Um, some of my best friends are Dutch. <laughs> <laughs> she can lie. Curled against the morning and stop tomorrow with the quiet of her sleep. I haven't played it in a long time. Um, I I, I kind of move on, and and as you get older, you know that your your subject matter changes. Yeah. You know I've um, I have a different whole different sort of a feeling about what love is uh, than when I did when I was a kid. 